So for those of you who don't know about Lion's Jaw, it's anchored by two intensives with multiple workshops running throughout the uh, week. It goes from Wednesday through Monday on Indigenous Peoples Day weekend. There's running classes all day and performances at night, and artists are just working with one another, seeing how we teach dance, how we build dance, how we uh, share these practices. It's really one of the only times during the year in Boston where there's such a dense amount of artists all together. Participants coming from Montreal and Berlin and California and uh, each year it's a little bit broader in its reach. Last year was one of my first opportunities into like teaching these ideas that have been a lot inside of uh, my rehearsal practice or my own process. They're intentionally putting people with really established practices, with people with less established, with people who are quite new to their teaching, all into the same festival, sharing the same performance nights. So there's something in that that feels very forward thinking and caring about what it means to grow a culture in, a, in an ethical way. It feels, it feels really fertile and beautiful. And then there's also folks here who are veteran teachers. So um, I got to spend some time with them and be working on my own practice at the same time. Lion's jaw meaning going to the edge of your abilities and your capacities and finding out what's possible. It's nice to have a lot of dancers in a small space sometimes because you have to negotiate, yeah, you know? Many other teachers have been in my classes and I'm attending other classes because I'm actually really curious about mm -hmm. what people are doing. And I grew up in Boston, so it, mm -hmm. I performed here when I was 16. Wow. Um, and there was nothing, nothing like this happening in Boston. And for it to continue, we need it to be sustained financially, and that's just a reality. It's really vital for, for Boston and for any community to have spaces like this. So again, this year we're asking for $8,000. That's what we're trying to raise. We feel we can do it with your help. We are fiscally sponsored by Fractured Atlas, so any donation that you do give through this campaign is tax deductible. We'd also like to thank the Boston Foundation for the Live Arts Boston Award, as well as Massachusetts Cultural Council for their grant as well. Tell people to come take classes, they're for everybody, and donate to our campaign if we can, even if it's 10 or 15 bucks.